Hi, this is Johnny Bergen, and we're doing another two-minute Chicago blues guitar lesson. This time we're talking about the four-bar intro to The Moon is Rising by one of my favorite guitarists, Robert Nighthawk. But this four-bar intro, form-wise, is everywhere in Chicago blues, whether you're looking at the music of Junior Wells, Muddy Waters. Um, this four-bar intro is it's used in fast songs, slow songs, it's everywhere, and I've noticed in my teaching career that it confuses people to no end. And so I've taken the drastic measure of creating a little chart. And we're gonna listen to uh, the first four bars of The Moon is Rising and follow along on this chart. Here we go, are you ready? Okay. And now we're at the beginning of the song. So that didn't have any accompaniment until like halfway through and then it had uh, the piano. But um, you could sort of tell when he does. When he did that note, you can kind of tell that at that point you're here in the middle of the first bar and you're on the B, the B second. So uh, as you can probably tell also, that pitch was a bit lower there. That was like an E flat. This is, I'm tuned to E. So either the record speed or, or the recording or whatever, they were just tuned to E flat. Um, that happens a lot, not a big deal. So does everybody understand the form? I think what I'll do is I'm gonna um, play that part. And pretty much everything is, this isn't like a, an E chord. And all these notes are here. Or they're here. This is another E chord. And they're here. Or here. Notice how those are the same things. If you can do that, and then do it with the slide, then you're in business. And pretty much all these Robert Nighthawk songs, he played, he chord had the same themes and he never played anything the exact way twice, but he played the same kind of thing. So uh, it's like a lot of Robert Nighthawk songs that are all so beautiful, like Call 630 and a lot of fabulous songs. So then there's a vibrato there. By the way, just use your thumb. I kind of have my thumb a little further back, like all the way back here. and. My thumb is anchoring myself so I can just relax the rest of my hand and do a nice live vibrato. So, as I was saying, it's all the... If you can do that, That's pretty much the four bar intro, um, then you're in business. And um, if you're, when you're playing with the slide, um, you gotta use your pinky, okay? If you're using your third finger, stop doing it now, forever. And uh, you'll thank me later. Because there's absolutely no way to play these chords. Kind of moving ahead in the song which is not really part of this lesson but um you can't do that if your slide is here so i hope everybody understands this four bar intro um you'll hear it everywhere if you listen to muddy waters like the blues had a baby you'll hear the same thing i just played just that so uh, good luck. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. We'll see you next week.